Hey guys, welcome back. It's me, Frugal McGee. Today we're playing Tecmo Super Bowl, our Cincinnati Bengals season. We're still undefeated, 15-0. We have one game left in the season, and then we'll have the playoff breakdown at the end of this episode. So first things first, Eric Wilhelm is still good. Boomer Esiason is average. We'll keep Wilhelm in just to finish the season off. We don't want to get uh, Boomer hurt. Uh, James Brooks is in good shape. Harold Green's excellent. Tim McGee's good. Eddie Brown's average. Rodney Holman's good. Icky Woods, average. So everybody's feeling pretty darn good. Fulcher's good. Come on, Francis. Bo be bad. Oh, he's always bad. Dang it. That's all right. As long as Fulcher's good, I'm happy. So let's go ahead and hop on into the game. Last game of the regular season for us. Playing the Patriots. The classic fabulous pink and white outfit that we all know and love by the Patriots. It's absolutely pink in this game, and I never knew why. I'm sure it was a palette limitation, but it's funny to think they're just very, very fabulous. So thank you guys so much for joining me here today. I hope you're doing well. I'm looking forward to more Tecmo Super Bowl. I'm excited to start our postseason. Also curious how the brackets are going to break down. Denver Broncos clinched their division, so that's Kind of interesting. Denver is... I don't know. I've seen him win it a couple of times in recent memory. Surprisingly, the Raiders... I'm surprised the Raiders haven't gotten it in a while. Ooh, starting off with a big fumble. That was bad off a big play by the Patriots. Wide open, Tim McGee. And there's an early touchdown. Eric Wilhelm was right on the money. Tim McGee with good hands. Fantastic. We'll take the early lead. First and 10 from their own 11. Gain of five on that last play. Ooh. Grogan got caught, just kind of ran into Leon White there. Oh, thought I could knock him down instantly. It didn't work. Stevens could take it. Yep, he's going to go. Big touchdown for Stevens. On this screen, it's more of a purple. Nice juke in there. Up to our 23. Big gain of nine yards on the ground. To Brown. And Brown's in the open field. Ah, they caught him, though. Harold Green manages to reel one in. Let's run with Brooks. We don't run the ball much. Nope. Oh, and then Brooks goes out. That, my friends, is why we don't run the ball much. That's all right. We got, uh, well, there's Icky Woods. What about Jennings? How's he doing? Oh, not good. How about... <laughs> hmm. I know he's a wide receiver. But I think we'll plug him in. Uh, maybe we should use Icky. Should we use Icky? Yeah, let's use Icky. Harold's still excellent. 
Okay. All right, Icky Woods. Mike Barber is kind of tempting, though. All right, New England. Big time touchdown. We are up 14 7. Ooh, nice stop there. He's just quick enough to be dangerous. There we go. Run over Grogan. Somebody stop the man. Please, you guys are killing me. Marvin Allen. Big catch. Got him on that one. I was hoping I could get there, maybe get a pick. Grogan's gonna run. He made it. They're working the ball. Oh, auto dive. You're killing me. That shouldn't have been that big of a play. All right, I'll let that happen. Man, these Patriots are playing hard. Yeah, they're doing really, really good. I was hoping by complimenting we'd get another big play. Ah, oh, he got me. <laughs> Thought I could tackle him, but I ran out of opportunity. He got it. It didn't leave me with much time either, so that'll probably do it for this half. probably gonna play it safe and just pretty much take it out of bounds might have time for a play that's definitely the idea okay there we go we got a little time to work I'm gonna launch this to Holman oh no I should just try to go around I try to cut through I don't know what I was thinking. Big catch, though. I was kind of surprised he caught it, to be honest. I kind of expected an incomplete pass. Earl Green. Are they just going to call every play I pick? Yeah, we'll just run. Gain of six.
Oh, bad throw. Take a quick look. Wilhelm's in good shape. Icky Woods average. Harold Green, excellent. Tim McGee, good. Eddie Brown. I have to say Eddie Brown, average. Okay, good. Third and four. Come on, McGee, catch it. Oh, dude. I, trying to catch in the end zone sucks sometimes. Let's try curls. Nah. <laughs> Just gonna run it. That'd be Harold Green. I, yeah, he's open, but Harold Green scares me a little bit. That's when he'll drop it. Okay, again, a six. Okay. Second and two. Oh, man. Of course they're going to call it. Ah, we got this one. It sucks not having James Brooks anymore. He's always one of those big time playmakers. One minute left in the third quarter. Whoa, wild pass by Grogan. And the receiver thinks he's got it. He must have suffered a concussion on the play. Oh, come on, oh, interception, please. Come on, we can pick off Grogan. Somehow he catches it. How does Stevens catch it with Fulcher on him? Kind of ridiculous. All right, into the third. Here we go, into the fourth quarter. We're up one touchdown. We just gotta keep on keeping on. Have y'all been watching some preseason football? I have not. I usually kind of skip preseason. Long ball to Tim McGee. There we go. Touchdown. There we go. Doing our thing. 28-14 Cincinnati Bengals. Booyah. Much luck calling their plays this game. Whoa, a long giant. Right on the money. That was a very high pass. I think he almost hit the stadium lights. Whoa. Man, Grogan just launches him. John Stevens, man, he has been catching. Even when he's covered, for some reason, he's just catching. Oh, my guy stopped him, but he still got the first. All right, 
right, good stop there. Only gained two yards. Come on, man. We just got to beat him. Only minute 48 left. Oh, auto dive screwed me again. Ah, he fumbled it. All right, 28 21. That's always scary. Well, I kind of wish he wouldn't have caught that. I lost seven yards. Well, Harold Green caught it. Got five yards. There we go, Harold Green with a big catch there. 22 seconds left. Kind of was thinking I'd get a little bigger of a victory in this game, but alas, not happening. Ah, oh, I thought we get one last touchdown, not quite. 28-21, still a victory. James Brooks bringing out Hurts. Using my backup quarterback kind of hurts a little bit. Still a good game. He had a good game. 264 total pass yards, 77% completion, completion rate. New England had 141 running yards. We had 54 on the ground. Not bad. I really... They had a lot of more production than they should have had. It's one thing I hate about later in the season on this game is they will complete passes that... I mean... They shouldn't be catching when they're when they're covered. They're throwing to, to guys that don't have that big of a reception rating. Quick little look. John Stevens, reception rating of 38, and yet he was covered and catching it. So the odds of that are ridiculously low, and he managed to do it with Fulcher on him. So give me a break. We're going to see how the rest of this uh, playoff bracket plays out, in case you're curious. All righty, let's see what we got here. Buffalo 1. The division, Miami with a wild card. Colts had a decent season, 7-9. We went 16-0. Pittsburgh's in with a wild card. Oilers are knocked out. Denver won their division with 11-5. San Diego's in with a wild card. That's a 9-7 record. Raiders had an 8-8. Eight eight. Washington won the division. Dallas right behind them. And the Giants also have a wild card. Minnesota wins the division. No wild card for the Bears, even with a 9-7 record. San Francisco and New Orleans. Look at New Orleans had a great season, 12 and 4. 12 and 4 would have been good enough to win most divisions in this game, but unfortunately they are in the division with San Francisco, so they did not win the division. That was one of their better chances I've seen in ever in this game. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, hit a like, hit a subscribe, leave a comment. Take care of yourself. Take care of others. Stay awesome, my friends. You guys are amazing. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. I'll begin our postseason. Thank you guys so much for everything, for being part of this channel and for watching Tecmo Super Bowl. I enjoy playing it. I'm glad y'all like watching it. And I'll see you in the next one, guys. Bye-bye.